Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm Brad Wardle. Call sign Captain Wingnut from Cougar Ridge Ranch High in the Uinta Mountains of Eastern Utah. This video is part five, the last in my fire part series on the killers I use to kill crawling, flying, and biting insects. This video is going to teach you how to safely kill biting insect pests anywhere inside or out. I'm going to show you how to turn your camping gear, hats, gloves, clothing in, into insect killers. And the best part is it's 100% safe for all mammals and 100% deadly for all insects on contact. That'll kill biting, stinging, annoying insects. If you haven't already watched my video, Five Killers, I've put a link up here and uh, in the description. You want to watch it to understand how this killer is totally non-toxic to humans and 100% deadly to insects. You'll also want to watch the other videos in the series to understand how all the other five killers work. Okay, let's get to killing some insects and protecting our clothes, tents, and camping gear too. Before I forget, don't forget to subscribe and click the notify button so that you know when I release new videos. Before we get started, please understand that this is what I do. I'm letting you be a fly on the wall and watch and learn from somebody who's been around the park a few times, but everything in life requires that you take a personal initiative and use common sense in all that you do. So if you don't like what I do, that's no problem. Nobody's gluing your eyes to the screen. Just click away. If you do continue to watch, please use your common sense and figure out a way that it'll work for you. Just don't do it if it's against your personal views or ethics. Think before you act. You don't need to lecture me and the other flies on the wall here on why you personally think it's wrong. We don't care. Please keep that to yourself and we'll all have a wonderful time. First, let me start by saying that this part of the video is going to be about killing pesky biting insects. This is not about repelling them. I have another video to show how to make your body a natural uh, biting insect repellent. I put the link here and I put it in the description but this video is about killing biting insects so they never get a chance to bite you or anyone else ever. Okay from the introduction this part is about using permethrin, pyrethrins. It's a commercially made product it comes is very, very red, readily available and it comes in aerosol cans of many sizes, 8 ounce mini jugs, 32 ounce quart jugs of concentrate and bigger if you need a ton of it. Just search the internet for permethrin and you'll find plenty and refer to the instruction part of this video for more information about pyrethrins. Okay, how do I use this? Well, I use it by spraying clothing. Keep in mind this is an emulsified oil so if you're using delicate clothing test a little spot first. I put it on tents, camping gear. You can use the very same aerosol to combat and kill biting insects and biting flies, including house flies, horse flies, house flies, yeah, house flies that bite, right? Horse flies, gnats, mosquitoes, fleas, ticks, chiggers, mites, bed bugs, more. This lasts for 30 days, up to 90 days. It can last up to six washings, but we, to be on the safe side, always just retreat anytime we wash them. Note, I like to mix my own. I'm going to give you instructions on how to do that in just a second because it can take up to six ounces to treat uh, one set of clothing. So uh, if you're buying the spray can, you can you can go in debt pretty good doing that. If you buy the concentrate, you can mix up a lot and you can treat a lot. All right, pyrethrins, pomethrin is the wonderful awesome sauce for killing insects. It's my favorite it works so well and it's so safe. Again, you can buy the aerosol can or the concentrate and make your own spray bottle. Just spray it on clothing, tents, bedding, flooring, any interior or outdoor, out, outdoor gear that you want to set and let it dry. 
Once it's dry, it's deadly. It's an insect killer, not a repeller. It's a killer. It will kill any crawling, biting bug that ventures and makes contact. It has to make contact. Before packing for a vacation, we spray our suitcase inside and out to make sure we don't bring home any bed bugs from our travels. It's deadly for a minimum of 30 days and up to 60 days, maybe even 90 days. Now, the airlines are not going to let you carry a full 25-ounce can in your carry-on, but you can put it in your suitcase, in your checked baggage. We carry a small personal pump in our suitcase and in hotels and places where we stay. We'll open the bedding and spray the bed, bedspread, sheets, and lift up the spread the, and spray the edge of the mattress. I keep one of the little bottles of concentrate so I can make more. We put it on the floor, we spray the closets, we spray the carpet, we spray especially where we keep our luggage as bed bugs are great at stowing away and going home with you. This way, if there are any bed bugs lurking, they're goners. If you want to mix your own, get a used pump, a hair a hairspray bottle, wash it out very well, including the pump. Or you can go to the $1 store and get a package like this uh, that's got a spray bottle in it. Mix the pyrethrin into the water. I've given you the ratios in the description and take it with you wherever you go. I actually don't even take a full bottle with me. I just take the concentrate and make it when I get there. It'll kill flying, crawling, biting, pestering insects on contact. Good luck. I hope this method works well for you and thanks for watching. I know it's been a long time coming. I enjoy making these videos for you, showing you what we do and how we do it. This is Brad from Cougar Ridge Ranch, high in the Uinta Mountains of eastern Utah. Call sign Captain Wingnut, signing off.